Hello everybody and welcome to another Nail Talk Live and today it's all about acrylic. Yay! One of our favorites. Yes, absolutely. One of our favorite products. We actually started using yeah. acrylics as nail tags. Yeah, but back in the days we just had white and pink. We had white and pink and of yeah. course acrylics is also the base of this industry. Everything yeah. started with acrylics. In Holland we even called those harsh nails. Oh yeah. Or yeah. like uh, wax nails. Yeah. <laughs> Before we knew that artificial nails were beautiful. Yeah. But it's more than pink and white, yeah. Yeah, yeah. We have endless possibilities uh, nowadays. Yeah, and we're going to show all of those possibilities. We're even going to show you how to create jewelry. Yeah, beautiful. Yeah, unbelievable. Yeah. We have a lot to do. We're going to get started. Start Yes, and we're all together again, and I think that all of us are started as a nail technician using acrylics. Absolutely. Yeah, old and golden. Absolutely. <laughs> yeah, how many years ago? Uh, well, it was uh, 1979, so that's quite a while, th that's 23 long. years, or 22 years. Yeah, 20 plus, we say. Yeah, yeah. of course. Yeah. 20, yeah. Plus 20 plus years. years. Yeah. Such a long Do time. Do you remember your first endeavors into working with acrylics? Yeah. Did it feel good, or did you struggle with it? Uh, in the beginning, I struggled, yeah. I made it too thick, of course, and a little bit lumpy, and uh, but it didn't take long until we got the feeling, and uh, yeah, this is a very nice product, and that's why I never stopped. Until now, I still uh, love to do acrylics also. So, and finding the best uh, mixed ratio. Eh? Yeah, absolutely. It was, was yeah. hard. Yeah. yeah. I needed mm. to practice. Yeah. But practice makes perfect, yeah. of course. And I really love acrylics because, yeah, you can pinch. Yeah. And the hardness. Yeah. And of you the learn the to start hand filing. The best yeah. The best way. Yeah. That's yeah, because true. it's hardest. Yeah. Product. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. It's very yeah. hard. Even now, when I have a class and uh, uh, and it, and it's with acrylics. Sometimes I forgot about it, mm -hmm. how hard and how strong acrylic mm -hmm. is, was or is, of course. Mm. Because when uh, my students are filing, they have a lot to do. And with Power Joe, it's a little bit softer. Yeah. But uh, yeah, well, acrylic, it's just the best. I think all my students, they love acrylic too. So that's very nice. But it's very hard to start with acrylics. Yeah, you really have to get used to the product, of yeah, course. Mm -hmm. that's true. And we say that it's quite hard, even though prestige acrylics are yeah. soft yeah. polymers. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, that's true. So it's a softer setting acrylic than mm -hmm. back in the day, because yeah. we yeah. really yeah. had yeah. like acrylic that you could use for dentures <coughs> and for <coughs> teeth. That's also how the industry started, eh? yeah. from, from um, um, uh, uh, teeth yeah. From a an dentist? a dentist? Yeah. Yes, thank yeah. you, Jessica. <laughs> <laughs> I was searching for the name. And the only yeah. thing that caught my eyes, uh, but there it started, yeah. back in the 70s. And, well, it not really started there. I think Neil started in the 1930s. Mm -hmm. But it was more fiberglass. Yeah, yeah. For the Hollywood stars. Yeah, yeah I, I thought it was in the 50s that the acrylic nails started to come up in yeah. America. A little bit, yeah. a little bit. Can yes. you yeah. But of course, in the 70s came yeah. the change from MMA to EMA. Mm -hmm. So a different yeah. base yeah. monomer was used, yeah. Yeah. and so it's really one of the oldest uh, products that we have. Yeah, yeah. Very and nice. very expensive in those days. Yeah, everything I heard about was expensive it. in it those was days. Not doable yeah. for a regular person. No, it to was wear nails. Luxury. To wear nails. Yeah, yeah. 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 Uh, it's like wimper extensions or lash extensions. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Was also extremely Absolutely. expensive when it first yeah. started, yeah. and now it's a common yeah. thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everybody does it. So mm -hmm. all about acrylics today, and we're going to not go into the traditional pink and white nails. We're going to do inlay nails. We're going to work with colored acrylics. Yeah. We're yeah. going to work with a lot of different techniques. Oh, mm -hmm. Great demos. Yeah. Oh, Great yeah. demos yeah. from our international nice. trainers. Yeah. And we're going to start today with an um, inlay nail, a simple nail, a mm -hmm. relatively mm -hmm. simple nail. Mm -hmm. uh, back in the day, we called this a glass nail because what was a glass nail? Yeah, it was transparent. Yep. Yeah. 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 I thought it was really made of glass. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. The first time I, r I read it, I was like, huh? Breakable. Oh, you yeah. yeah. <laughs> so be but it's really careful. Really transparent. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And um, the disadvantage of a glass nail was always that you could see your natural yeah. nail. Yeah. yeah, that's true. true. You could only do one time with a set. Yeah. yeah. Or, or hide with rhinestones Absolutely. Yeah. the second time. Yeah. yeah, yeah. But then it grew out. Yeah, and then it was done. So let's go to the first design. It's made with a silver fun box. And it's done by Nadia from Canada. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So let's see, what is a glass nail?
Oh, great. I love this box. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Especially for inlay. Mm. Perfect. Also on the air nails. She's yeah, an easy yeah. trainer. Of course, clear <coughs> acrylics, precision mm -hmm. clear acrylics. Make sure that when you use uh, acrylics, especially a clear, that your mix ratio is perfect. perfect yeah. mm -hmm. Because otherwise you see air bubbles. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. So the mix ratio with precision powders is two parts monomer to one part powder. Yep. And you can see that she really lets the acrylic settle. settle. Yeah. Yeah. That's Don't very start overplaying no. it. Yeah. But it's very hard uh, to receive that um, uh, one third of uh, polymer. Well, it's practice. Yeah, that's practice. Yeah, and it also it's a, it's a little bit determined about in uh, uh, the atmosphere in the salon that's where you're working. That's also true. Yeah, that's the true. The moisture levels really yeah. influence it. Also, the warmth of your hand. Yeah. The warmth of the hand. Yes. It looks the great. The size of the bead, the size of the brush. But we can see that she really has a lot of control. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And Perfect. you also saw that she took off a little bit extra. Yeah. So don't be afraid when you're working. If you see that that needle is going to be too thick or too long, just remove it while it's wet. Yeah. That's a lot easier yeah. than having to do it when it's dry. Mm -hmm. Yeah. These are just beautiful butterflies. Nice. Yeah. So fun. Yeah. With acrylics, you can go on and on and on. Yeah. So that's nice. I love to go on and on. And yeah, on. that's true. Yeah, it's really your thing. <laughs> Oh, I love the butterflies. Yeah, they're so much fun. All of those elements in that so nice sandbox. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can do make so much beautiful designs. Yeah, it's true. Especially when you do it also with air, air nails. Air nails. Yeah. Yeah. A simple oh. nail that you made yeah. that was really s beautiful yeah. with the yeah, black. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so the butterflies are applied. It's all applied in a semi-wet acrylic. So when it's still semi-wet, you can push it in. Yeah. If it's a little bit drier, you need a little bit more acrylic to. Um, fixate all of your elements, mm -hmm. but then make sure that the uh, beads that you take are tiny, yeah. otherwise the nail becomes too thick. Oh, I love these glitters. Nice. Nadja yeah. is using Pro Formula Royal Wedding from the <coughs> cuticle downward. Of course, as we saw before, there is a layer of clear underneath yeah. this glitter acrylic. And that is really important. For, especially when On you do the fill, yeah. mm -hmm. when you want to remove the color, yeah. also because it may result in a little bit of lifting yeah. mm -hmm. if you don't use the yeah. clear layer. But it's especially helpful when you want to file off the color. Yeah. Yeah. Play c pay close attention to the cuticle line, because of course this has to be as sharp as it is with uh, gel polish as well. Yeah. yeah, of course. So this is the crystal clear, and now she's capping. If you have difficulty doing this with a clear powder, you can also use a pink powder. Then you see the arch a little bit better. And the clear powder, especially the natural pink, is really very clear. clear. Yeah, and very clear. It's beautiful. Yeah. You can also see that she really uses a flattened brush. Mm -hmm. You think that maybe it's a square brush. No, it's an oval brush. Yeah. But she flattens it out when she takes up the bead of acrylic to, in order to be able to push it down into the nail surface when she applies it. So the natural nail is hidden by the glitter, and we have the butterflies flying around. <laughs> mm -hmm. Of course, the scotch tape was there to fixate the form a little yeah. bit easier, and you cut it that way. You don't do that on a client. Is this what we call a ballerina nail? Yeah, this is Lisa? a perfect yeah. shape. Yeah, a perfect one. Oh, well, no, it's not that straight in the end, but... No, a little bit. A little oval. bit. Good. Ah, uh, beautiful. Well and very I clear. think it's not really oval. <coughs> I think the corners are there, but they're yeah. Oh, yeah. transparent. Yeah. And you see the silver yeah. foam box. It shines yeah. like yeah. diamonds nice. in the sky. Beautiful. beautiful. Yeah, yeah, beautiful. Yeah. So easy. Yeah, and of course, back in the days, we used to do this on ten nails. Mm. <laughs> of course. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. 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 But why not? Beautiful. Well, perhaps it's a little bit much no. for time. the current taste. No, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, no but you no. could combine this, of course, beautiful with the black gel yeah. polish yeah. or, or, yeah, or silver yeah. Yeah. to make it a little bit more wearable, yeah. perhaps. And Even though the nail is super fast to make. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, yeah. It is. As it an is. accent nail. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, very nice. Well, beautiful. we have the prestige powder in how many colors? Ten. Ten, ten uh, different ten colors. colors? Yeah. Yeah. Oh ten. my god. Ten <laughs> <different> <laughs> colors. Yeah, that's a lot. So we have choice. Yeah, we even have four different colors 
camouflage powders to mm -hmm. yeah. find the perfect solution for your clients. Yeah. Yeah. And we have a little commercial, I think. <gasps> yeah. Let's have a look. So, what is your favorite color, Syriza? Well, we were talking about it. Yeah. I think the opaque. Yeah. Semi-transparent so pink. A little bit, a little bit milky. Yeah. Like a frosted or mm -hmm. something. Yeah, I like that very much. Yeah. No, yeah. I agree. I also like that a lot. Yeah, beautiful. Deborah. Well, I have to choose between the pink and the uh, cool camouflage. I like that color yeah. very much. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. It's because it's a also a pink and very uh, natural on the nail also when you blend it out a bit. Yeah, so yeah the cool pink yeah. is really cool. Yeah. It's a yeah. camouflage powder. Yeah, I love it. Yeah. And yes? Well, the same as uh, Cerisa, but uh, because I do not uh, work with acrylics anymore, but now you say uh, the cool. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, I agree. That beautiful. was a beautiful yeah, color a beautiful too. Color, yeah. And I love the, uh, the pink, mm -hmm. but the hot pink as well. It's yeah. a, it's a yeah. bit yeah. more. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. yeah, the hot pink is more yeah. like frosted yeah. than the opaque, yeah. opaque. Mm -hmm. But it's from transparent, blush, opaque to hot pink. Yep. Yeah. And then build on. Yeah. Anyway, if you want to know more about the Prestige powders or want to start using the Prestige products, of course, contact the distributor in your country and they can help you further in getting on your way with our acrylic line. Mm -hmm. Well, we're staying in the inlay theme today, yeah. Yeah. or for now. Mm -hmm. Nice. And we have <laughs> another demo. Who's it from? Bianca. Bianca Feigam. Talking Feigan. about uh, mm -hmm. dis distributors. Uh, yeah, from Germany, yeah. Yeah, and she's making, uh, she made a beautiful uh, inlay nail. Yeah. yeah, with a lot of things happening there. Yeah. Oh, yeah. great. Special effects. Yeah, great. <laughs> yeah. Very yeah. nice. A lot of depth. Let's yeah. check out our national trainer for Germany, Bianca Freigang. Of course, using a soft bond primer, yeah. it's smart to use soft bond primer because it ensures adhesion, but the Prestige liquid also uh, adheres perfectly without yeah. a bond, mm -hmm. yeah. but just to make sure that, to prevent any problems. Yeah. She's working on a real finger, which is really nice to see because it still gives it a little bit more reality. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. yeah, absolutely. And also clear. Just sculpting the nail very thin, yeah. as you can see. Yeah. She took a small bead yeah. of product. Yeah. Yeah. A little bit wetter. Looks a little bit wetter. Well, I think there's a little bit more liquid in the brush itself. Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's also possible. And then black. Mm -hmm. I would now prefer to have a different me. brush for black. Hmm. Hmm. I love Why? it. Because of the uh, the pigments. If you want to take, uh, if you want to make your clear uh, application right now, it's better to use a clean brush. Mm, I only do that with the uh, glitter acrylics. Yeah, yeah with the glitter. Gl yeah, with glitters. the glitter. Yeah. Here we have the shells. So those special nice. effects. And the leaf gold. Yeah. Perfect beautiful. on that black background. A yeah. Beautiful combination. But I love this. Yeah. 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 It's a little bit like you did last Wednesday, uh, Theresa. This nail. Yeah. Yeah. It looks. Yeah. It's a little bit similar, yeah. like the uh, colors like this. Yeah. That's true. And I didn't saw this that good. I, this is the opaque. This is the, let me check for you. Because it's I a little bit milky. hot pink. Oh, even. hot pink. That yeah. gives a very nice effect, like a little bit of a milk pot nail. Yeah. The Beautiful. cool would be more covering and more beige in tone. Yeah. You can see that this is more yeah, semi-transparent, but it gives it indeed the milky bath yeah. look. And of course, clear over the whole nail. Mm -hmm. Uh, to keep the clarity of the design. Mm -hmm. You could also take an opaque pink and mm -hmm. then it becomes a totally cloudy yeah, nail pink. Yeah. yeah, that's cool too. Yeah. Julia Vorobieva does that a lot also with the frosted yeah. pink fiber gel, of, yeah. of course. It's a very long You can also nice. see that she uses her brush differently. Eh? She's really using yeah. the beginning the of the brush, so the belly, and she's really pushing it in place. And it's also to have a better see-through nail when you do that. Oh, these, these pliers pinching. are the expert, uh, mm. the pinching tool for experts. 
Yeah, you have to be very careful with that one. Yeah. <laughs> I love pinching acrylics. Though. Yeah. Yeah. This is a skin protector out of the air nail system, and it protects the skin against the paint, and it's for easy removal yeah. of the paint later yeah. on. And she uses the air nails form as masking, but the side of it. Yeah, so it's uh, you can use any air nails masking. Yeah. Yeah. And that's a smart way. You don't have lines. Yep. Use the side of a, a, a masking. Ta-da! Yeah, beautiful. Yeah, cool. Really I fast, one. straight black yeah. lines like it, this. It's like a stiletto nail inside an yeah, helmet nail. Yeah, that's true. And it looks really small, really yeah. uh, thin. Why is she doing this? Slim. Removing the excess, maybe a little bit? Yeah, so it's really important to remove those air nails paints uh, really on the hairline of the nail. Otherwise, it Because otherwise it would chip, yeah. Ah. So it's a little bit of bond after removing. And now I always do uh, uh, one layer of base on top. Yeah. And then uh, a top uh, of choice. Hmm. Well, I really like this. I especially like the effect of the shell underneath the hot pink. Yeah. There in the middle of the nail that, that you feeling. see a shimmer inside yeah. cream. <laughs> I love it's this, Bianca. Yeah. You Absolutely. are just amazing. Yeah, she is. She makes yeah. beautiful things. Yeah, huh? and I've known Bianca for years and years and years, but all her nails are just stunning. So if you're yeah. lucky enough to be in Germany, contact Bianca and get your products Go or get her. education yeah. from her. Yeah. Because we saw that she's the national trainer, but also an expert trainer. Yeah. That means that she is able to create any shape. Anything. 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 Just yeah. anything like magnetic. magic. Ah. Yeah. Before we continue, we go to the socials. And I believe yeah. Syriza is waiting for us. Yeah, I have something very great. Because when I think about acrylic, I have to think about one person. Uh, and that's Tony. I think Tony Lee. Or, oh, of course, I think about Pepin. Pepin, that, that's of course. the first thing. Yeah. <laughs> but that's all about the 3D uh, elements. Eh? But now this is a real build-up nail. And uh, I think it's very nice. Let's see. This is uh, yeah, a very uh, great abstract design. And uh, you can see the beads. He's... Uh, He's placing the acrylic and then he's cutting off every piece to make very straight lines and a little bit like, a, yeah, it's very abstract. How can we call this? Yeah, yeah I agree. Yeah, and abstract. the knife again. It looks a bit scary like uh, this. It looks scary, but oh my God, yeah. I have to try this. He I don't know why I never magic. tried this. But uh, really, Jessica, this is magic. Very nice. And they have a lot of designs like this. I have a second one after this. But look at this, piece by piece. Yeah. I think it takes a lot of work to oh create yeah. a thing like this. I would yeah. wonder how long does it take to make one nail like well, this? Well, let's try, Jessica. Yeah, let's do, Sirisa. Yeah. So the point <laughs> of wow. the cutting look is at this. straight line. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, every cut the, uh, uh, creates a straight line, so yeah. you have uh, like a mosaic uh, design. Yeah. Yeah. Very nice. Yeah, I love um, this very much. Couldn't you do this with air nails? Yeah, of course. <laughs> yeah, of course. <laughs> yeah, of course. But yeah. what's yeah. fun about yeah. that? <laughs> yeah, but yeah, yeah. What's fun about that? Yeah, well, or it's just air nails. Paint. Yeah, that's or true. Yeah. That's true. Yeah, yeah. yeah but it's a different faster. outcome. Okay. So yeah. It's yeah. Still and the That's difference true. is that this is a build-up. So it's if you love to create a build-up nail and you love to work with acrylics, so well, why not uh, try this as well? And if you love air nails, well, show us your designs. But first, uh, the gonna, we're gonna look at the second uh, uh, second movie movie. Or and this is again. Um yeah, but look at this. This is a uh, um, this oh is yeah, a little I bit like a baby one. boom yeah. and a little bit of a, a, a technique that we saw half. before. Again, mm -hmm. Tony, and he's cutting in half. Look at this. This is even great <laughs> if you see this. It's a very fun way to work with your acrylics. So he's only working on one half of the nail now? Yeah, it's half of the nail. Does he guess a half price like this? Or? Uh, <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> uh, yeah, and then the whites. Okay. Well, strange, eh, if you see things like yeah. this. Yeah. But if you use your imagination, you can create a lot of very interesting designs. And I think this is really an acrylic technique because gel or power gel you will always do it. flow back. Yeah. 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 So yeah. this is only yeah. possible with acrylic. Yeah. yeah, I agree. Look at this. It's a very strange nail, but uh, I think that's uh, fun. It's an arty nail. Yeah. Look at this, very great. Very tight lines as well because mm -hmm. he used a, a, a blade for this. And I think it was, it was very funny. Can you see this? I think it's it's perfect for a picture. A mm -hmm. little bit crazy, a little bit strange, but uh, you can only make this with acrylic. So this yeah. is typical acrylic design. I well, I hope you like it. And uh, what do you think, guys? Yeah, it's um, yeah. Yeah, 
Yeah, yeah. Cool. <laughs> cool. No, cool. it is cool. And his I nails are beautiful. Artistic. Yeah, yeah. The, the nails yeah. they make in the U.S., some of the nails are really amazing. Yeah, yeah. The first time I saw him and uh, 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 Tony was like, oh, it's really scary to see the knife uh, on, the, on the nail. But he makes beautiful, beautiful things. Well, I feel it's uh, scarier when you go for a pedicuring service and the knife's underneath your foot. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I that is scarier. Uh, yeah. yeah, because then they're working in your skin. Yeah. 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 Directly that's, that's in your really skin. That's really scary. Yeah, I think so. Uh, he was using colored powders, of course. Yeah. And yeah. that is also, uh, the acrylic started with pink and white, or it started with natural powder, actually, mm -hmm. and then came pink and white, clear a little bit later, because it was difficult to create a clear yeah. powder. Mm -hmm. And then in the beginning of the 90s, mid-90s, came colored powders. And the drops. And color oh drops. Yeah. yeah, make all these colors. Nice. To, uh, yeah. to get your monomer tinted. Yeah. Yeah. But the yeah. color powders are, of course, something that uh, really took off in, in the years 2000 to 2010. A lot of glitters, a lot of colors, many, many, yeah. many, many, many colors. And then it fell down a little bit because mm -hmm. of gel polish. People yeah. started to wear different types of nails. Yeah. Yeah. But of course, still the color powders are there. Yeah. And the cool thing with color powders is you can use them on and on and on. Who made our next design? Oh, it's very great. Also with uh, colored powders, it's mm -hmm. Joanna from Ireland. Uh, Joanna, and she's also using stamping, I believe. Ah, yeah, well, it's very great. It's beautiful design. So let's see how to combine stamping with acrylics. Again, that easy trainer, I, it's a really, an un, uh, you need that as a training tool. Yeah. The yeah. whiteness of the natural nails, of course, the tip that was inserted into the easy trainer, which is a natural tip, so mm -hmm. keep that in mind. Yeah. It's not a Leuke Nigea nail. <laughs> and of course, also clear acrylic. Back in my yeah. salon days, the clear acrylic really went fast. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. A bit of pinching. It's easiest when you want to create a nail with um, layers with acrylic to do the pinching on the first layer. Mm -hmm. Because that, and it really keeps mm. also its pinch, its C curve, unlike gel, which opens up a little yeah. bit when yeah. you apply a second coat. So yeah. place, uh, uh, pay attention to that first coat of acrylic. And this is, of course, the nail bed cool camouflage. Yeah. It's a color yeah. that yeah. we discussed a little bit earlier. A very pointed see. nail bed. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I love it in that way. Yeah, yeah you do. Yeah, yeah, you do. At the cuticle, she used opaque pink for a beautiful and even transition into the natural nail. And this yeah. is also opaque pink to blend the cool pink into the naturalness yeah. of the free um, cuticle line. Okay. And Fire. the filing of the smile line. This is not an absolutely nece necessary step. No. Eh, but acrylics, not so much. But she also files a little bit. Yeah, it depends on what you want to and create what is this? at the end. Bond because she's using a different type of yeah. product. Is that a necessary step? No, I don't think so. Not but necessary for sure, an inlay, but To be sure, yeah. you can do that. Here we harm. go with the colors. She's, she's yeah. using the Ultra Designer, a brush that is more used with the um, Plasti Gel, yeah. but of course can easily be used with acrylic. Yeah. Yeah, Especially with, with this technique, it's details. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. This is neon yellow, in case you didn't see. <laughs> <laughs> And neon orange. She's working bit by bit like a 3D kind mm -hmm. of application. Giving that depth. Yeah. Yeah. She went to a different brush though. Yeah, this is the sculpting gel four, I think. Or uh, mm. you know what I mean? Yeah. The oh yeah, Ooh, this that's is cool. gel brush. Now it becomes a little bit coral. Yeah. Oh, yeah, she's playing with Sweet. the colors. Oh, it, yeah. it reminds me of the 60s. Yeah, yeah. yeah. flower power new. Yeah, flower yeah. power. All very flat, eh, because it's yeah. inlay, work thin, work evenly. And then when you start to cap it, especially when you have different uh, volumes in the nail, different heights, make sure that you clear it a little bit on the wet side. Yeah. yeah. And don't fall in the trap of using one big bead. Mm -hmm. Use a couple of beads. To make it easier. Yeah. Yeah. Even, li even like this is already fun to look at. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, that's my Your stamping plate. plate. <laughs> oh my <laughs> goodness. Hand drew by yeah, me. Nice. Such a cool plate. Give an accent. Well, yeah, so an she's accent. now stamping with yeah. the liner gel on the nail bed. Yeah. Just hiding everything underneath. The color of the nail bed is very nice, though, I think. And she starts touching up yeah. a little bit. Adding some extra elements. And here we have hidden flowers. Oh, this is cool. Yeah, the orange nice. really speaks. Yeah, yeah. True. Beautiful nail. And of course, if you're in Ireland, you can always contact Joanna for her mm. classes. She does a lot with colored acrylics, hand painting, yeah. Yeah. painting with gel. She's yeah. a really nail art artist. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, she's yeah. very creative as well. Very yeah. creative, yeah. and she creates also totally out of the box. Yeah, nails. true. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. As we yeah, saw last true. week. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Last yeah. week. Yeah. The, yeah. the extreme. Always fantasy. combining, yeah. Yeah. combining. Yeah. 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 Trying, trying. Yeah. That's good. I love that. Yeah. So, we have more. We have a full show today. Yeah, yeah. Really well, yeah. a lot. Yeah. But that's because <laughs> acrylic really goes fast. Yeah, yeah. absolutely. Yeah. 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 So it we can uh, show a lot. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, so our next design is done by <laughs> Dorothee. <laughs> and she is from France. And uh, she has made a beautiful nail with uh, colored acrylics as mm -hmm. an overlay. So Full overlay. Full overlay. Oh, yeah. a full overlay. Again, crystal clear, we're going to go full overlay, so that means that we have to protect the natural nail. You can see that you don't really need to be very fast when you work with acrylic, if no. you just let it go. Mm -hmm. yeah, it's it just Especially with stay prestige. Calm. Yeah. Especially with yeah, prestige, yeah, yeah, because yeah. as long as you keep contact between the brush filled with monomer and the bead of a polymer, mm -hmm. it stays pliable. Yeah, but it's very important that you use exactly how you use your brush because she's using the tip of the brush for the blending and now the belly of the brush to flatten it out. Flatten it out. Ooh, she mixed so. and put it into small dappin dishes. That is smart. Mm. Yeah. And oh, she's taking... Ta-da! She's taking... Oh! Making Ooh. the marble. Oh, marble! This is going to be like a tie-dye. Yeah, oh, well... The colors are like that. Little bits. Yeah, the colors are like ah. that. Yeah. Beautiful. That's a really artistic nail. Something you can do with acrylics. Yeah, of course. Yeah. Super cool. And, and of course, the paper colors. that she works on is the paper palette, so that she's able to take it off of the paper palette. Yeah. And that is something that also Vorbieva does quite a yeah. lot. Eh? Yeah, she does. And the first time I saw that, I thought to myself, huh? Yeah. But now you see that it takes off, and the world starts using this. Another fun color combination. Well, it's the same like we do with the gel, when we put all yeah, those colors together. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Only you have to work very fast with acrylics. Yeah, we do. A little bit wetter. Oh, yeah. Oh, huh? black? Yeah. Black but pourquoi je ne, je ne comprends pas? Idea. I think contrast in this design. It's always oh, yeah. a good contrast. But you could also do that with, with liner gel black or with yeah. uh, air nails, True. of course, yeah. Yeah. to make it easier to remove the black because the black is quite yeah. saturated yeah. with yeah. pigment. Mm -hmm. So to be careful, do not apply the black on top of the natural nail, no. the black acrylic powder, because it will really demark the natural nail. It's absolutely vital that there's clear underneath. Would you combine this perhaps with black nails? So then you do two or three of these, and then the rest totally black? Yeah, well, I think you have to. Otherwise, yeah. it's a little bit too much, yeah. I think. But that's me. And oh, just you could neon uh, rhinestones on the black nails. Oh, yeah. Yeah, of course. Yeah. To, to bring back the neon yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. accent. I True. think that is cool. A little bit of clear powder. Mm -hmm. Sometimes we think we need to protect the colors when we with a clear layer of product. That's not necessary because the, no. the pigmentation no. is inside yeah, that's the nail. Yeah. Yeah. It changed a little bit. Yeah. The yeah, it's soft it's design, but, but the clear still is great. used to smooth out mm -hmm. the surface. She really puts down her bead also in, in a very 
precise way. She yeah. rolls it off the tip of her brush. Yeah, I do that too. You do that too? Yeah. I never did that. Well, sometimes for capping a stiletto yeah. nail, perhaps, because yeah. then you have to yeah. pull have the to, whole yeah. length. Yeah. And now filing. With a nail like this, you have to be careful that you don't apply too much on the sides of the nail, because then it can become bulky. Yeah. And now she's using Lima Gel White and the little Dotsky, or the dotting tool, of course, <laughs> and, and I love Dotsky. <laughs> Dotsky. And it really accents. borders then yeah. the black. Uh, yeah, you could also use rhinestones. Of yeah. course. <laughs> yeah, true. Okay, and now the top gel to protect everything. Or not. Oh, no, she can apply some. She's putting on rhinestones. Rhinestones. She hurt you. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, and of course she's using the wax tool to apply the rhinestones, yeah. and um, that makes it easy to apply the rhinestones. Be careful that sometimes you need to clean the upper facet of the rhinestone to make it shiny again. Yeah. yeah. And of course the top gel is really fixating everything. You could also use the gemstone gel, yeah. but yeah. the top gel is also quite thick and has the added benefit that it shines, so yeah. you don't get the matteness around the rhinestone that you would have with the gemstone gel. Yeah, yeah that's true. Now she's using Supreme Finish to really live and give life to those neon colors and to shine bright as a star. A beautiful nail. It's almost wow. like a this. dance in the volcano of neon. Yeah. Yeah. True. Yeah. <laughs> that's a great way, and yeah. the lava is the black. That's we have true. more socials, Theresa. <coughs> oh yeah, let's go to Jessica. Yeah, that's right. I went on TikTok as well, and Theresa found a beautiful uh, thing, a demo from Tony's Nails, but I did too. And he uses different kind of tools in this uh, demo. So let's go have a look. It's really fast, and he is working. And oh. look at that. He's Chuck. Oh. oh. And he now oh, is great. filling up that that's part. Cool. I really love it. And that is a special effect. Yeah. I wish it would go And fast. really fast to do uh, with acrylics, I believe, huh? Mm -hmm. If you yeah. see this, you want to try it. Yeah. That's yeah. Well, it's right. relatively fast. Why? Because you still have, b because you can also use air nails. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. well, but this is always about the yeah. acrylics. That's so the answer yeah. for everything today. Yeah? No, yeah. but it's really cool. No, true. I yeah. think that abstractness has uh, more depth when you do it with yeah. acrylic. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I think so too. And I think it's more of an art uh, form like this because you really created it uh, with different kind of tools. So special effects, huh? I found another demo and that is talking about those special effects. Let's go have a look. She's creating on tips uh, with acrylics, a beautiful, and maybe you remember those lamps from uh, back in the days. Oh, nice I had lamp. one with those uh, beautiful neon <gasps> colored oh, yeah. acrylics. Those, yeah, those Making lava drops. lamps. Yeah. Oh, oh. And yeah. Yeah, it doesn't move, but it's a lava oh. lamp. Oh, I love it like this. Yeah. Oh, that would be really Great. rad that it would move in, in that cool. nail. Huh? But I really love the white and the bright uh, colors uh, next to them. So lava lamp, special effects. So I found another, uh, just a joke. So a special <laughs> effect on a nail. <laughs> that would be rad if that was real. Oh, my God. But it's just a filter, of course. But if I, I want those, those nails, nails. <laughs> yeah, I want those nails. <laughs> I want well. that. Oh, <laughs> yeah. beautiful. So that's what Ooh. I found uh, on, um, on the internet. So, uh, as Sylvana says, some nail inspiration for you. Yeah, and before we continue, we need a little bit of oomph in our life, a little bit of sweetness, not on my nails.
Yeah. Oh, I always get a craving when I see that. Mm -hmm. Me too. But I love sweets. Mm. That's why I love you guys. <laughs> oh, <laughs> sweetie. Um, who we also love is Katerina. Yeah. yeah. From Ukraine. Yeah. And Katerina is always making the most beautiful designs. I know that she also started with acrylics mm -hmm. because I've known her now for 12 years or something. Yeah. And she was really an acrylic technician and then slowly she started using gels. Yeah. Um, but she also has a design for yeah, us. Yeah, she does. And she's combining stamping uh, with acrylics and uh, as an inlay. So I really love because I, um, when I use uh, acry used to use mm -hmm. uh, acrylics, I love to combine uh, stamping. Yeah. Oh. Special well. effects again. Okay. Mm -hmm. Well, let's see what she does. Cleaning the nail with prep and wipe. Always a necessary step that we don't yeah. punctuate enough, perhaps. Yep. Gel polish bond. You have to pay close attention when you apply gel polish bond to make sure that you cover the whole nail. The way she holds the finger now during the working is a real typical Russian, yeah. Ukrainian yeah. thing. Yeah. Holding it from the upper side of the finger yeah. mm -hmm. and then turning it like this. While yeah. in Europe we tend to hold the finger from yeah. the yeah. under yeah. side. I think that's better for your uh, body as well. Yeah. Because this is a very uh, hard Unnatural way. Yeah. way. Yeah. Well, yeah, I think it's a thing of yeah, what you prefer yeah. and that you do every day. Yeah. So she's using now the stamping. And this is the black stamping and she's using the white stamping plate. Yeah. Uh, stamping stamp. Stamp. <laughs> stamping stamp. <laughs> Not stamping plate, of course. <laughs> when you now apply this um, color, hey Jessica, the camouflage powder, won't it kind of dissolve the stamping underneath? No. No. No, um, you you really need to uh, take care that you don't work too wet. That is ah, really yeah. important. And, and, and you're not swiping around yeah. the smile line. that is really important. And this was liner gel black, of course. Yeah. So it's cured. Yeah, yeah. With nail polish, it would be a little bit that more difficult. That would be really difficult and a little bit scary. I agree, yeah. But maybe you can uh, uh, take off the sticky layer to be sure. Yeah, mm. but just don't work too wet. Yeah. Look on your mix ratio. Yeah, Don't what you do you think of the proportions of this nail bed, Deborah? Uh, I would make it a little bit long. Mm. Yeah. A little bit in this way for this nail, if you find it a bit shorter. Yeah. It, 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 it's nice. I, I find it very feminine. Yeah. Mm. So what is she doing now? Oh, that is something that we used to do a lot, Deborah. Oh, in making our time. black. <laughs> yeah, of course. No, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> making the shadow. When we didn't have the liner black yeah. in the days. So black acrylic in the corners of the smile line yeah. and on top of the knee. Oh, uh, that. Is she going to file that off? Or yes, she part, of the design? <laughs> <laughs> part of the design. No. <laughs> <laughs> Again, an artistic nail. Okay. I never did this. I did this with power gel. Yeah, that same I did way. Too. Same. Yeah. Learned huh? it also in the Ukraine. What happened in between? Uh, she removed it with she her brush. She blended it. Oh, she removed the excess. Mm -hmm. yeah. And then you are left with this. So it's uh -huh. marvelous yeah. Yeah. feeling. Yeah. A again, a little bit tie-dye. Which yeah. brush is yeah. using there, Papain? I Let's think she was see. using a smaller brush. Oh, this, the, the brush is here. Yeah, that's the... Emperor? Emperor, yeah. The Emperor or the Empress brush. So those are the quite expensive Japanese brushes, handmade, but all brushes are, of course, mm -hmm. handmade. But these are made of the most soft and pliable hair to ensure retention of liquid into the brush. And of course, the beautiful golden, gold plated ferrule tells us it's a Japanese brush. Like the Ikebana. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah that's true. true. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, the metal core. Love the metal core. Yeah, With the hygienic final system, it makes it a little bit more sturdy and heavy. Yeah? Mm -hmm. For well acrylics, like it would for be a good Yeah, for it's acrylics, perfect. perfect. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, well, this is a nice end result look. I think this is great. Yeah, cool. And I love the stamp on that uh, see-through. Yeah, you don't really yeah. see a lot of the stamp. No. It's really it's just, just a, a, a detail. Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
It's all about that marble design that yeah, you create. Yeah, the marble. Of course. And you can pick the color. I would have added like. some flakes on the top also. Yeah, oh, of course. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm, stones, so. <laughs> I'm on that page with yeah, you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So, if you want more inspiration, follow Katharina on Insta or on Facebook because she does a lot oh with yeah. air nails, yeah. but yeah. also with all the other products. Yeah, mm -hmm. she is. And, and this is a totally different way to use your acrylic, so yeah. that's very nice. A way so that nice. even kind of dumbfounded us because we were like, oh, yeah. what is she doing? Yeah, true. So, yes, Katharina, you did amaze us and surprise us. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> uh, we are now going to stay within the abstract theme. Yeah. And we're going to Beatrice yeah. from... Uh, how do you say it in English? S Switzerland. S Switzerland. Oh yeah. yeah. Switzerland. It's just the same Switzerland. As <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. And she's made a beautiful, beautiful nail, a stiletto nail. Yeah. Yeah. A great nail. It reminds me of nails that we used to make 10 years, 15 oh yeah. years ago. Eh? Mm -hmm. So much. We did so many of those stiletto nails. I think the only nail we made. Yeah. yeah. Or yeah. square when yeah. the client really insisted. Yeah. yeah. But okay, but then was nothing in between. No. <laughs> <laughs> and long. Did you yeah. really ever long wear nails. a long set of stilettos? No, I never did. Uh, <laughs> in that days that I worked and I made stiletto nails, now if I watch back, it's like a pointy almond. So I, <laughs> I was thinking that was a stiletto nail, but uh, no, no, not that much. We've all been there, Sarisa. Oh, <laughs> We've terrible. all been there. Mm -hmm. My first stiletto nails were just ultraform tips that are a cup pointed yeah. oh and yeah. then it was yeah. like yeah. claws. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but enough about the older days. Beatrice is going to show us an abstract nail. Very cool nail. Gorgeous nail, yeah. So let's see what she's making. So, starting uh, on a real nail, on her own nail, of course. And first she's working with the uh, opaque pink. Uh, well, I think this is actually the warm pink. The warm pink. Yeah, because it's a slightly warmer tone than the cool yeah. pink. Yeah. Uh, this is the warm pink. Okay. And she's going to seal it in with the opaque pink. Oh, okay. And which brush did she yeah. use here? Well, I think this is a sensei. Click on 10, sensei. I think. No, it's hmm? a sensei. Sorry? Sensei? It's not the click on, click on 10? It could be the click on Prestige, but I think it is a sensei because the hairs are a tiny bit shorter. But that also happens sometimes when you use it for a long time. Yeah, that's true. Beatrice, of course, did a lot of competitions. Yeah. She's a really skilled nail technician. Yeah, yeah, and she, she also is. did acrylic competitions. Mm -hmm. This is also great with that faded... Uh, I love yeah, to beautiful. have that yeah, as, a nice. yeah. as a base nail. As a base nail. This yeah. gives yeah. you Absolutely. endless possibilities. Yeah, beautiful. Because you can do anything now. The natural nail is hidden. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A little bit of clear. Yeah, that's clear. It's a very long nail, right? <laughs> Beautiful. A long nail. And you can also see that this clear is on the wet side. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So that's why she handles it with such care. Yeah. Really soft yeah. movements to the end. And here comes black. our favorite black mm. acrylic. When you use black, a little goes a long way because the liquid inside the hair of the brush also turns yeah. black. Mm -hmm. So be careful when you've never worked with black acrylic. Yeah. yeah, that's true. Try it first before you do it in a nail. Because you can see when you blend it out, it really goes almost over yeah. the whole length of the nail. And true. she's even removing uh, yeah, some excessive. Yeah. Oh, look at oh, that. Oh, she's wrinkling it. Yeah. Wow. She's creating a little bit of... Uh, Oh. Yeah, kind of like yeah, yeah. with the cling, cling foil structure uh, in the nail. Structure. Yeah. Structure. And these are the chromes with the fluffy brush. Oh, this oh is and some chameleon nice. flakes. Oh, I already love this like this. And the color beautiful colors the purple with the together. Copper. Yeah. Oh, and the flakes. Oh. And the flakes. Yeah. And just creating some glue for those flakes, yeah. of course. Was it with the bond? With bond. Yeah, bond. just yeah. with yeah. bond. Yeah. It was really smart. Yeah. And just dapping those flakes on place. I love this. Beautiful. It's great for fall. Also yeah, yeah, yeah. Well. Gives a fall feeling. Because Again, when you see this, colors. you want to try it out. Yeah. yeah. Especially with the crinkly. Yeah, very nice. And the capping, of course, with clear. Yep. Yeah. Don't overuse the product. Don't make it too thick. The base layer was already relatively full. Yeah. So make sure that you work thin 
and evenly, but you need enough product to protect the yeah, design. Yeah, that is true. That filing. is true. So now filing that beautiful stiletto in shape. Again with the metal core. Oh, this is <gasps> beautiful. Wow. Yeah. This looks like something you did in the oh days. Oh yeah, Pepin. Pepin, back in the days. Yeah, those the abstract elements. thin lines. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, it's beautiful. And, and the cool thing with this is you can do this on 10 nails yeah. and yeah. just do the lines a little bit different yeah. and yeah. you have a yeah. total set. Yeah, yeah. Wow. So beautiful. shadow yeah. and the dark Look at black that. Depth. I love it. Yeah, now it's a beautiful nail. I love the yeah. colors. Yeah. Love it, love it, really love, it, love, love it. it. And again, some rhinestones maybe at yes, the cuticle. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> but beautiful. <laughs> So yeah, we did you. that a lot, eh? Yeah, Nails like we did. This. We did. I even remember a poster of um, a set that you did, mm -hmm. kind of similar than this nail. Oh, probably me. I did a lot of. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Those were very and cool. And you used all different kinds of colors yeah. underneath. Yeah. And then and that a print. lot of green, which he didn't really yeah, want. He didn't but love, but, but it's it was a beautiful. A beautiful. Set. Yeah. yeah it still is. Yeah. Yeah, of course. I know but nails huh? a little bit. Trend setting yeah. on point. 20 years ago. Yeah. Anywho, we have more socials, yeah. and now it's up to Deborah. Yes, it is. I also went on TikTok, and as you has, have seen with uh, Sarisa and with Jessica, uh, she uh, showed them uh, movies of uh, Tony, but I saw a movie, or a movie, or a little film, from a girl who also cut the acrylics, but then with her brush. So let's see. Okay. As you can see, she's making little squares and doing it with her brush. Oh, yeah, I saw this one too. Great. Yeah. Yeah. It's really easy to do it like this also. And it gets yeah. sharp because she's filing. Yeah. 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 So to like be 3D. more safe on your yeah. client, you can yeah. also like do it with 3D. your brush. And I love it. Yeah, yeah. Nice. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. yeah, stunning. And of course, we have some more. And this is a totally different thing. Yeah. But I really love the tiny details in this one. So let's look further. Oh, I love We started with details. the tips, of course. It's very uh, foreign. A little black, ac black acrylics. Oh, love. But this one, this is going to be so. Oh, nice I saw detail. this also. Beautiful. Yeah, so oh, yeah. nice. A treasure yeah. hidden. Oh, yeah. 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 I love that this. is cool. Yeah. But the complete set with the black and a little detail. Oh, I really love this one. How would you make that hard? Do you think? Maybe before and then put it on. Yeah. I yeah. think or it's just a mold. With, uh, with a, with a mold, mold can also. It's mm -hmm. so perfect. Or just a little. Or with a little nail. cutter. Yeah, of yeah. course. Yeah. You can also cut it out. So, yeah, there are multiple ways to do that. But we still have one, and this one is a complete set, and I was blown away from. So let's look. You blown away? Yeah, well. Okay, let's go have okay, a look. Yeah. I love well, the glitters yeah. in this. Yeah. <laughs> <here> in <the laughs> house. I'm going to sit down. Long now. nails, of okay. course. Long nail bed. I love yeah? this one. Yeah. Oh, I love it. But the glitters. I love a glitter acrylics. Really great. And then, oh. Well, because of the end result and the blue and the little fading, everything together is just a great set. Little combining Ooh. with the aqua colors. Cool. I mean, rhinestones. Everything in it is like me. That's why <laughs> I love <Yeah>. it. <laughs> yeah, true. Just not the shape. And the, well, I like the shape yeah, also. Yeah, but nice. oh. yeah I really love this. And then the this. top over wow. those glitters. Glitter, shiny. That yeah. Oh, total feeling, Deborah yeah. nail. It's Deborah. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's why. Totally. Yeah. So, well, this one's wor uh, the day... Uh, Today film, so see you next week. Yeah, cool socials, cool yeah. nails. Yeah, super cool. Yeah, and those that last set was really, really Deborah. It is a screaming <laughs> Deborah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Cerise, did you ever create jewelry with acrylic? Yeah, I did, Pepijn. In the last Corona lockdown we had, I yeah. wanted to have a live um, a broadcast with uh, little uh, rings, very mm -hmm. nice, made from acrylics. Mm -hmm. Actually, very simple. Yeah. But I know you can do a lot more with yeah. creating jewelries. Yeah, we also, I back in, again, back, yeah, in, the back days, in the days, we yeah. also make pendants. Yeah, we did. And on phone cases. Flowers on, on your uh, phone. The brushes <laughs> oh. were yeah. all yeah. acrylic flowers. Cigarette flowered. cases. Yeah. Mm -hmm. with yeah. A, yeah, back we in went the day, we also smoked. <laughs> with acrylics. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, we did. <laughs> <laughs> Me neither. Um, the yeah. next demo, or our last demo, is like jewels taken to really the next level. Yeah. yeah. And sure. of course, it's, it's done by Julia Vorobieva huh? from Russia. Yeah. She is, we are very proud that she's our trainer. Yeah. But yeah. she just keeps on going. Yeah, like always. Creating. Oh, creating, different creating. kinds that of minds things and like techniques and yeah. products How? and everything. And yeah. Beautiful. Yeah. So this is going to be a ring. Yeah. Enjoy. Mm. 
So we see here a Jopolis bottle, and she took a glove, a finger of a glove, and she pulled that over the cap of the bottle, mm -hmm. yeah. okay. like a little glove. So she can remove. <coughs> yeah. Yeah, that's smart. And this is the air needle, so oh. you can create all kinds ah. of tools you can use um, to um, to make those acrylics designs. And the Ikebana brush again. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's and smart. So she's side. using yeah. both sides yeah. of the needle. Yeah. 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 If you want to wear it, it has to be uh, uh, the perfect size of your nail, uh, yeah. your uh, finger. finger. Yeah, but this is but not you something you wear. <laughs> no, well, no. you can have it resized by putting acrylic beads inside oh, the, the ring. Oh, that's true. Oh my you god, You can make so it smaller, easy. not bigger. Oh, well, you can yeah. make it bigger by opening it up Cut and it then melting it together. Or, or, or filing it a bit with the e-file. Or filing oh, it a bit with the e-file. Yeah. Oh, that's a lot of work. So now comes this come the scales of the future um, thing. Yeah, I don't want to no reveal reveal mm, yeah. what it will be. And this is just it's the a base. Surprise. Yeah. yeah, but already so detailed. Yes, unbelievable. Yeah, but the thing is with uh, things like this is you have to build the details in from the start. Yep. Yeah, yeah, because you cannot change the bottom layers later, or you need to use the e-file to to bring in yeah. detailing. Yeah, yeah. And it's really smart that she's using that camouflage yeah. uh, thing, so you can really see what you are doing. Yeah, yeah. It's already beautiful. She yeah, works like on this different Even areas this of color. the nail. Uh, or the that. finger for the ring. Wow. <laughs> and uh, now it's very big, but it in real life it's so small. No, it's not that big. Yeah. True. No. Yeah. You see a gel polish bottle. Uh, yeah. The cap. It's not really big. Oh, so that was Continuing. the back side of the yeah. ring. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the part that we nor normally don't spend that yeah. much yeah. money <laughs> on. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. Yeah, but you know, when you have a uh, heavy upper thing of a ring, it yeah. always rolls around yeah and it's on the back of your finger so you need the mm. great back side of the yeah. ring yeah that's true so she's using the detail in number three with yep. the acrylics yeah. of course she did that earlier in the show uh, this season also but it still is gives of course a good control yeah. to your yeah. product yeah yeah every product <laughs> yeah yeah <laughs> yeah that's true but i never would would have thought of no, uh, about no, using yeah. this brush acrylics do we already see what it is not yet no ah well maybe if you look very close maybe you can guess no 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 well maybe no, no. i don't think so no i know i no. don't think so no and she go on and on and on <laughs> yeah yeah the real demo took about three hours well oh which is still okay yeah, yeah. i would have thought really much longer all of those tiny elements. Yeah, yeah but she's beautiful. already so used to doing those things. Yeah, okay. Yeah, that's true. We would do it in three weeks, I think. Yeah, I three think months so maybe. Yeah. Even a normal nail for me, it costs yeah. three hours. <laughs> 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 Not talking about me. Okay. There's more. Acrylic. What do you think about the weight from this thing? Well, it's quite thin, so I don't think it's so heavy. It's not going to be very heavy. No. no. Acrylic is a light product, of course. That's true. Especially compared That's to true. metal or to gold yeah. or, or yeah. silver. I really love that she's using that air nails needle yeah. for those extra details. And yeah. again, air nails is yeah. smart. Perfect. For the each way design. to go. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> again, it's coming back, the air nails. But if you would do this with, uh, with your spatula, your lines oh, would possible. be much thicker. 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 Yeah. So yeah. I really love it. And of course, because she uses the point of the needle, she can also make movement inside yeah. the yeah. lines. Yeah. With the spatula, it would be a straight line. Yeah. And they, these lines that she made with a cabana, you can really caress and pull them over. Yeah. So it's a different type really of motion. Yeah. I think people now can see a little bit what she's creating. What is this? The tongue. The tongue. The tongue. Ooh. Cool, huh? Yeah. Wow. So she's now working on the lower side. Would you dare to wear this? Of yeah, course. but not every day. Special occasions. Yeah. Maybe without and a just tongue. Look. Hmm? Maybe without a tongue, because th I think that's a little bit more fragile than yeah, the rest that's of fragile. Yeah. Well, you could Maybe. reinforce that with a little bit of metal wire. Mm. Mm, yeah. Yeah. 
It's almost like, it's uh, awesome. how do you call that? Gorgles? What's on the uh, cathedral? Gargoyles. Cathedral. Car gargoyle. Gargoyles. <laughs> That's Which gargoyles. you can find on uh, cathedrals, uh, cathedrals and yeah. churches yeah. 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 Mm. Yeah. that yeah. You are there to release the water from the roof yeah. of yeah. the cathedral. Oh, I thought, always thought for bad spirits. For what? Bad spirits to keep those Ow, out. Yeah. Out. Yeah. And it's also history. Well, um, yeah, times, it is. Yeah. What you say is true. Yeah? Okay. But it's also an architectural element yeah. to remove it's the smart. water. Both. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go back to the nail. <laughs> <laughs> so we see that uh, Julia is still working on it. Yeah. To make it even more detailed. I think I couldn't stop. No. 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 But then the way it would be a bracelet. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, complete dragon. Yeah, complete dragon. Just, uh, on the wrist. <laughs> on the hands. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And yeah, then yeah. going around the wrist yeah, to, yeah. Your exactly. to, to your upper arm and then going across your chest. And then around your, your neck. <laughs> that is cool. That's <laughs> <laughs> total sleeve, yes. Yeah. <gasps> that will be awesome. It's a little bit Japanese inspired. Yeah, yes. yeah. Love this. Yeah, absolutely. So and it's totally 3D mm -hmm. in front. And all done with acrylic. Yeah. And only one powder. Yeah. Yeah, because she's going to uh, do no. something else. Yeah, of course. Put that needle something uh, somewhere else. <laughs> they can little hair over there. Yeah, beautiful. So it's really kind of a mustachy feeling, huh? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, of course. Yeah. Yeah. Those um, need to be there. Yeah. It cool. is uh, the Chinese. Oh dragon. my God, Julia, this is just amazing. Yeah, yeah. but it is. Oh. And it's getting better. Some, some silver air nails paints. Oh gosh. Liner gels. And she's mixing that liner gel with the extreme moth to keep it moth. Yeah. Very smart. Yeah, it's just shading. Yeah. yeah. Just shading in and highlighting a bit. Is this the Amazing. fiber coat for fiber. the pink, I or is this of yeah, something milky? No, I think liner gel white mixed yeah, with, with a little bit of oh yeah. mm. Oh, that's a coo cool way of doing that. Yeah. Wow. I'm missing rhinestone. Oh, oh, oh yeah. there you are. Yeah. Awesome. I would wear this one. one. Love this. Wow. Yeah. And so round. Okay. Do you want my address? <laughs> 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 Unbelievable. Wow. Wow. Amazing. Wow. Unbelievable. Hmm. Yes, speechless. Wow. 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 Speechless wow. Yeah. again. Yeah. 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 Always yeah. makes us speechless. Yeah. yeah. But Beautiful. how fun to make a design like that. Oh man, so cool. Yeah. yeah. Creating art, pure Absolutely. art. Well again, with different ideas tools. Are coming. Mm -hmm. yeah. 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 That's also yeah. nice. Yeah. Be creative, use wow. acrylics. Mm. And of course, the prestige acrylics are best for all of that. Oh, what a thing to see. Make sure that you follow us on Instagram, because we do a lot on Instagram. And, and on, on YouTube, of course. Mm -hmm. yeah. Put on your notifications so you can see everything that we post new on that page again. And of course, you can uh, look back and um, search for a different kind yeah. of loose demos or shows, past yeah. shows. So there's a lot going on. Oh, yeah. Yeah, and of course on Facebook. Uh, yeah, of Facebook. Course. Of course. Yes. Hello. Yeah, that's natural. You are natural. here, so <laughs> stay here. <laughs> uh, so you can always have enjoyment through Neil Talk Live because on Mondays we are live, on Wednesdays and on Fridays, and Fridays is the international show. Mm -hmm. What's our theme next week, Deborah? It's about rubber bases and the seal protect. Oh, cool. Yeah, mm. so that's I going to be... I think that's your show. Yeah, all about the natural nail and yeah. to make it even better and more perfect. Yeah. So I love it. Yeah, we're going to explain how to use seal and protect mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. what it yeah. does. And then how you can use it together with the rubber bases. So we're talking interesting. Interesting. Yeah. And Very. also really salon oriented. Yeah, that's yeah. what I want yeah. to We've say. We've been orientated yeah. more on art yeah. and now we're going back to the nail studio yeah. salon yeah. to create something that you can use yeah. in your daily work. True. So short nails, natural nails. See you soon. See you at News of Life. Bye-bye.